Welcome to my YouTube channel. Uh, we're going to talk today about the Burley Pro front bumper guard. Uh, some people have some problems putting it on their yak, uh, getting it to stick and uh, seal up tight to the yak. What I found out and I used was a two and a half inch uh, ratchet strap and it's about 28 foot long. I wrapped it over the top of the yak, around the bottom, and I had my ratchet strap up about here and tightened it up. I followed the instructions on the Burley Pro. I put the uh, keel guard on, drew a line with a pencil around it or a pen. I sanded underneath to uh, get a little bit of a grip for the marine goop. I sanded the inside of the Burley Pro bumper guard and then I took alcohol and wiped everything down. I took the Burley Pro and I put the marine goop inside it and I also put it on the boat itself. I put it on and then I tighten the ratchet strap up and around. The advantage of doing it this way is you've got even pressure pulling it up against the yak and it doesn't slide off like if you ran it crosswise across the yak. And what happened was by having that even pressure I was able to let it sit in the excess marine goop would come out the edge a little bit along so I knew it was getting a good seal. I left the strap on for about a day then I came out and peeled off all the excess marine goop, cleaned it and I took silicon and I ran around the edge like the instructions say and it put a real good tight look. Come here. Uh, on the Burley Pro you can see that it's pressed up against there nice and tight with no major gaps. It worked real well. Uh, the trick is to use the two and a half inch strap. Your strap will get a little bit of marine goop on it uh, because as it spooges out, especially at the bottom and the front, it's going to come out and touch your strap. That's the only negative, but it peels off pretty good. If you want to look at other uh, tips and hints uh, on the Hobie and how to do things, we're going to be putting some out also. Another good site to go to is Burley Pro. Uh, they've got a lot of good hints and tricks, and I've used a number of them on this yak. Thank you very much for watching, and we'll see you next time.